down here doing this since 1993. He is the Legislative Vice President for the Associated Gun Clubs of Baltimore, Mr. John Jocelyn. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. It's a pleasure to be here. The governor and the Maryland General Assembly have an obligation to protect the rights of the Maryland citizens. The last session, they failed. Not only did they fail, but they intentionally destroyed essential elements of our freedom we hold so dear. They did this for political expediency. They said it was to make us safer. Do you feel safer? No! Do you think the people in Baltimore City feel safer? No! Do you trust those who don't trust you? No! Do you believe that those who lack the imagination, whose only response to a crime is to take away the guns from the people who didn't do it, are deserving of re-election? No! Are you willing to do what it takes to keep Maryland free? Yes! Do you believe that anyone who would sign away our rights to advance his political agenda and his political career should become President of the United States? No! Do you believe if he were to become President that he would protect your rights? No! Are you willing to stand with me yeah. to fight to take back Maryland in 2014? Yes! Are you willing to continue the fight in 2016? Yes! Do you believe, as I do, that we have an obligation to our founding fathers yes. to stand up for freedom, yes. to protect our homes, our families, yes. and the liberties that this country was founded upon? Yes! And stand up for your legislators who stood up for you. Work for them. Give them your energy, your expertise, any sufficient aid you can give to make sure that they are reelected and those who do not deserve it are not reelected. This is the free state. Let's keep it free. I'm proud to be here with you. I'll be working with you on the next elections. I'll see you in the trenches. Thank you so much. Yeah.